Hello children, it's time for your active learning at home lesson and it's a literacy lesson. Today we are going to do the B sound. Today we are going to look at the B sound and we are going to identify the B sound and try to understand the difference between B and D. And as something extra, we are going to watch a video. Are you ready? Can you look at the pictures and say the words with me? I see a bank. Blue balloon. Bucket. Bus. Can we say them again as I show you which ones? Can we say this one? Bag. Blue balloon. Bus. Bucket. Well done. Let's go to the next one. Can you read the words with me? Careful now. Look out carefully. I see a baby. These two birds. Baby. Well done. Let's see the next one. I see a bird. And this is where you must put the other B. I'm going to try really hard to write it in for you. Bird. I see a bike. Very good. Let's see if we can do another one. I see a B. There we go. Did you notice that the B has a long and then you go up on the line and then you go around and back down again? There's your B sound. Let's go to the next activity. Here we go. Now, this is a perfect B, and if you look at the arrows very carefully, you'll be able to see how to write a B. So, you go down. I'm going to try to go down as carefully as possible. And then you can pick up your pencil, or you can go back up on the line. And then here you go around. Oops. B. I'll go with another color quickly. Let me try and use purple. So I'm going to go again. I'm going to go down. And now I'm going to go up on the same line. I'm going to try to do that. And then around. And there's your B. Moms and dads, you can ask them to practice it in the sand with their fingers. And the thick crayons, the B is not always easy to do. Let's go to the next one. Right, so we looked at that very carefully and we wrote the B. Here we have a capital B and a small B. We go down and we can pick up our pens, pencils and we're going to go in and we're going to come back on the same line and we're going to go around and in. That's your capital B and your small B. You go down, can you go back up on the same line, and you go around. Again, moms and dads, it takes a lot of practice. Practice with nice thick crayons or with your fingers in the sand. Let's see what we're going to do next. And here we have a row with a small B, and it gives you the nice perfect outline of the small B. And if you want to, you can make a row full on a clean piece of paper. And here's the big B. And we're going to make the capital B if we look carefully. And you must try to make another one. And you're going to do that on a clean piece of paper for me. Let's go to the next one. 
Now, to be able to see the difference between B and D, look how cute these pictures are. The mommy B has a belly for B, and the other D has no belly. Actually, has a little bum. Can you see? Right. So there you got a B for belly. And the does don't have any bellies. Right, let's go to the next one. Write the words and draw a picture. Do you see the word ball, block, blue, bird, box, bug, bat? All these words begin with B. A ball, say it with me, ball, block, blue, bird. Box, bug, bat. I need you to write those words and draw me a picture. But before you do that, come and look at a video. I made this video specially for you. So let's take a good look at it now. Right, let's Hello see. children. Today we are going to do the B sound. But we are going to integrate it with a few other skills that you've learnt along the way. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to look at balls. Here are the balls. And if you remember, they are the primary colors. Yellow, red, and blue. And we count one, two, three, and we say ball. Can you say with me? Ball. Well done. Next thing we're going to look at is a banana. This word, this word also begins with a b, banana. Say it with me, banana, ball. Good. Next thing we're going to look at is a bunny. I'm sure you got one of these for Easter. So this is a bunny. And how many bunnies do we see? One. How many bananas do we see? One. How many balls do we see? One, two, three. And if we do a little bit of revision of the primary colors, they are yellow, red, and blue. Let's look at another thing that begins with a B. is a box. And inside the box is a bulb. There we go. And we have one box with a bulb. The next thing we're going to look at is a block. Here's a block, and you'll recognize it. It's a Lego block, and it's the same color as the ball. We have two red items. One, two. A block and a ball. The next thing we're going to look at for a B is a bottle. We have one bottle. And the last thing that we're going to look at is a... Bowl, a blue bowl, and there we have all our items. And I'm going to put the blue ball inside the blue bowl, and you're going to say all the words with me again box, bulb, bottle, banana, block, ball, bunny, and box. Moms and dads, if you look around the house, you'll find many items that begin with B. Till next time, boys and girls. Bye-bye. For more fun, please find out more about the B if you go to the following website. I hope you enjoyed my lesson today. Goodbye.